top tips for future leaders are one, to have vision, two, to anticipate change and embrace it, and three, to be curious and have imagination. So if you don't have a well-articulated vision, something that's succinct and um, really well planned out and thought out, no one's gonna know what to do. And then they're also not going to have um, a framework within which to innovate. As a leader, it's important to anticipate what's gonna be next. What is your market going to want? What is your audience going to want? Where is business going? And what can you add to that that not only makes your company look good, makes your leadership really understand um, that you're there to help them succeed and you really want to see um, the company grow through change. I think the third tip that's really important is to always be curious, always be learning. Uh, if you are not consistently upping your game and growing, you're going to be irrelevant extremely quickly. Um, always um, doing lots of research, lots of reading outside your particular discipline. Um, it can be in education, in art, in business, um, in different leaders that you really admire and want to emulate. If you are consistently looking on the horizon and not just looking at your particular area or point of view, you're going to get new ideas and you're going to think about how do I take those ideas and apply them to my business? I'm pretty passionate on the idea that we need to rethink the credit union member experience. Uh, I love going to places like Nordstrom and Apple and uh, in and out Burger <laughs> and finding ways that really seeing how they make their customers feel joy and create an experience that they uh, want to go, that their consumer wants to go out and share. And I think in the credit union movement, we have such an opportunity to create a space for um, consumers to talk about financial services in a new way. And um, I think the way we do that is we look at every part of our business through the members' eyes. We need to think through how do they, how do they join? How do they um, come in through our website? How do they learn about us? How do they interact with us? Every single interaction should be a wow experience. I believe it's possible for credit unions to be a well-known category. And I think it's a shame that we only have 7% of the market. I think that we have accepted that place. Um, though there are some standouts. I, I don't want to say that, that we all are on board with that, but as a category, as a movement, we should not be a secret. We think about telling the story of our products and services in a kind of a one at a time, a la carte fashion. And I think as a movement, we need to do a better job of telling the credit union story. And if we all do that together with one voice, we will be well known, we will no longer be a secret, and we will be a force to be reckoned with.